everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we've got something extra special for you. We're taking a quick lunchtime adventure with Willa and I'm also dishing out some valuable Vishla advice. Lately I've been flooded with questions about how we train Willa and how she's such a well-behaved Vishla, so thank you all. I've also had some of you reaching out with issues that you're facing with your own Vishla pups. So before we dive into it, don't forget to leave a comment below if you are. I read every single comment and I try to respond within a week. But if you're itching for a chat, head over to my website and fill out the contact form on the contact page and I'll shoot you an email right away. Okay, let's get into today's topic. There is a misconception that having a house with a backyard is enough for your Vishla. Some people have called me out for living in an apartment with Willa without even watching my videos before commenting. But if they did watch my videos, they'd know about our morning runs, our walking routines, and all of the outdoor adventures that we embark on on a daily basis. See, the argument some people make is that if I had a house, it would be okay. However, I've had homeowners contact me with issues about their vishlas too. After hearing their stories, it becomes evident that their pups aren't getting enough physical activity. Vishlas get a bad rep for destroying things and, and being overly energetic, but that only happens when their energy isn't properly spent through physical activity. Trust me, when they've run and played to their heart's content, they'll happily snooze for most of the day. That's why I wanted to take you on this quick walk today because it's less than 20 minutes, but it's intense. We run Willa really hard, we play with sticks and throw her chuck it because Vishals need to be in that full sprint at least once a day in order for you to get that sleepy, cuddly version of them at home that we all love. So if your Vishla is wreaking havoc at home, chewing up all of your stuff or digging holes in the backyard, that's their way of venting all of that pent up energy. If you're having a tough time with your Vishla or any dog for that matter, this is a great opportunity to show you that it doesn't have to take up a ton of your day to get your pup running. As you might know from my daily walking routine video, I absolutely love being outdoors, walking, running, and hiking. That's why I chose a dog that can keep up with my lifestyle, and now I feel like I'm keeping up with hers. But it might not work for everyone. I'm fortunate also to work from home, which allows me to take her out a few extra times per day that someone that has to go into the office might be able to do. The bottom line is that your Vishla needs a daily dose of running. Not just in the backyard, but in vast fields, tennis courts. You should also check out our tennis fun video where we run Willa like crazy with our tennis rackets and tennis balls. It's really fun or on hikes. And you guys have obviously seen Willa on her hike. She loves going on hikes and it gets her really tired for the whole day. It's up to you to give them the space to burn that energy or else they might turn your home into a war zone. And please remember that it's not their fault. Vishlas were bred to hunt animals, keeping up with an army that was on horse. So their stamina is unmatched. And in doing your research on the breed, I hope that you know this about them. Okay, and lastly, I just wanna say that I know a lot of you watch these videos as you research before you get a Vishla or while you're having difficulty with one. We did a ton of research before getting Willa and still, there are good days and bad days. Because this is the world of social media, you see all of the good, happy Willa, us cuddling and our adventures, but we have tough days too. And when I feel like Willa is regressing in her training or when weeks go by when she has to stay on leash because she's not responding to recall, I do get down on myself too. And I feel like this is a lot more than I signed up for. And I just wanna be transparent with y'all that having a Vishla has been harder than any other dogs that we've had. But if you can give them this physical activity every day, I promise it does make things better. But we're not perfect, I'm not perfect, and neither is Willa. So I need to remember that she's not gonna be perfect every day. So again, like I say all the time, patience is a skill that I'm constantly working on because I need to remember what she was bred for and what I need to do for her as an owner to make her better so that she can in turn make my life better. It's a two-way relationship and we both need to show up for each other. Okay, that's it from me for now. Once we turn back from this bridge here, we'll head back into the open field and you can watch Willa run like crazy. 
Okay, please enjoy watching Willa run full tilt.
Okay, there you have it, pup parents. Please let me know what you thought about this slightly different style video. As you all know, I'm here to help you all and myself become the best dog owners that we can be. So get those paws moving and you'll have a well-behaved, happy pup in no time. If you haven't already, make sure to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and ring that notification bell for more tips, tricks, and adventures with our family. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.